Oh, here we go. Yo, Gary. You need guns, you can't leave. I know who you are. Sir, I'm Chris Hansen. I know who you are, sir. I so how do you know who I am? Because I've seen you on TV before. Well, what are you doing here, sir? Matt? And one has a chilling warning for the sheriff's office. And he actually was uh, glad that we're here because there's a lot of people in here that are just like him. Take down with Chris Hansen. with the Monroe County. Los, you look good. Hey, thank you, man. I appreciate that, man. Michigan Sheriff's Office Violent Internet Predator and Exploitation Response Team, or Viper, in their latest operation to combat child predators. Almost immediately, a Viper decoy posing as a 14-year-old boy as a man wanting to meet. He tells me about the sexually suggestive texts. Did he give you a name? Matt. Said he wants to come over, sit with me, rub my back, and be kind to me like my baby. Um, I asked what he wants to do. He said, I can really use a massage. I'll give you one, two if you'd like, then really want to make out and kiss you and suck my neck, my nips, and a good BJ from you. And I want that. This guy is getting mad. Like, he wants to be here because he's asked for it like five times. The Stinghouse is set up and ready to go. The Viper team is in place and poised for the takedown. In all my years of doing predator stings, I've never seen anyone make an entrance quite like this. Your eyes are not deceiving you. This man lives so close that he has just rolled up on a custom neon green golf cart. But he's not heading to the first tee. He wants to tee it up with an underage boy. This is Matt, and he lives in the same neighborhood just a few doors down from our sting operation, bringing new meaning to the devil next door. Unbelievably, he doesn't even try to sneak inside to meet his 14-year-old boy date. He actually takes a few moments to chat with fellow neighbors. Anyway, I'll holler at you. All right, let's just about us later. Now that the neighbor happy hour has ended, Matt is ready to meet the 14-year-old boy he thinks he's been chatting with Wait, online. Wait, what? But not before he grabs his travel cooler of beer and his cell phone. He's so brazen with his illicit rendezvous that he's actually wearing his house slippers. But he won't be so comfortable when he's confronted by me and the Viper strike team. Coming. Let me get my charger real quick. Hey, Matt. Gonna need you to sit over that stool right oh. over there. Dude. Dude, please. Please, I cannot do this right now, dude. I need you to sit right over there. I know who you are, but I, I'm not here for whatever it is. Well, then you can tell me about it, but you got to go now, dude. I can't. I know what's going outside. They're already here. Who's here? Is anybody here? Who? I'm just going to leave, please. You can't. I have to, sir. No. Sir, I have to. Sir, I'm Chris Hansen. I know who you are, sir. I have so to how do you know who I am? Because I've seen you on TV before. Well, what are you doing here, sir? Matt? You're here for no, a boy. No, no, no. Okay, no, 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 Excuse me? What's your password to your cell phone, Matt? I'd have to have my lawyer for that, sir. Just relax, Matt. Yeah, I'm, not gonna gonna you, I'm not Matt. doing nothing, I promise. I'm you not doing nothing. No, I do not. Okay, roll over. Yep. Roll this way. Yep. Yep. Hey, Matt. Yep. You talked to someone who identified themselves as a 14 year old boy. Correct. Right. I said I had just said I just wanted to hang out. I didn't say anything. That's not what you said. You said you wanted to have a massage? You wanted to have him suck your neck. You said you said you wanted a good to, BJ. I have, nothing, I have nothing to talk about, sir. Please and you me. said you want that. Just arrest me, sir. 
my lawyer will. But you said all that. My lawyer, my lawyer will tell everything. I didn't say anything. My lawyer will talk. It's for in me. the transcripts, Matt. My lawyer will talk for me. Thank you. Well, you don't have any explanation for this. How far did you travel, Matt? Tell you everything. No, why am I under arrest? Outside. No, am I being detained? So why am you, I under you're arrest? You're under arrest, sir. What for? Right? What? For meeting with a 14-year-old boy. But that's not why I'm here. So these okay. guys, these guys are going to walk out, walk you out the. I'm detained, so I'm being detained. You are you're under, under arrest. arrest. You're going okay. to jail. You're not detained. Okay. You're under arrest. Okay. Could you please, please not film me? I don't want to be on camera. You don't have a choice, Matt. No, actually, you made the I choice. Know, I know that. I know that I don't. You know want the law. Be on camera. So you're a lawyer, man. No, absolutely not. So why lawyer, do you think sir. you, why do you think you have a sir, choice about sir, being I on camera? Have, listen, you walked all, into a very, place. You're a very intelligent man. I read, I don't really don't want to have a conversation about it. I just don't want to be taped, please. And I know that I have. Well, you don't have a choice. You don't have a choice, Matt. At least not to be taped. You please. have to be taped. You made the choice to walk in here, and you gave up your right to privacy. I asked if everything was okay, and if I. When I saw that, I had no idea. I said, hey, you're not like police or anything. Like, I'm, I just want to come hang out. That's right. what I put. And yes, of course, but you talked about this is coming from a website, by the way, where people meet. That's by the I just want to be like that very clear that I wasn't doing anything illegal. I didn't come here for anything illegal. I came here to hang out. That was Have you met other 14 year old boys from this website? Not. Have you told other 14 year old boys you want a Absolutely BJ not. and you want that Absolutely ass not. after you said that you wanted Absolutely him to not. suck your neck? Absolutely not. What do you think would have happened, Matt, had we not been here Chris, and a 14 year old? Before. Chris, I've seen your show before. Turns out I have a fan in golf cart Matt. And while he was pretty quick to shut down in the beginning, he's not. Guys, here's the thing anyone who's saying this is fake, number one, you're slow. You gotta be slow. Because what person would take this job? Let's say this is an acting job. What could it pay? Probably nothing, dude. Maybe a couple thousand. Maybe, uh, maybe a couple thousand, right? Why would you take this job and now you're labeled as a pedophile online? Why would you do this? This doesn't make any sense. No human would do this. So sitting here being like, yo, bro. That shit fake. Okay, so it's fake and he's and he's and he's pretending to be a pedo. Someone says cause he has glasses on. Let's see every single person that comes in has glasses on, bro. Now all too happy to talk with me. It's not fake, dude. By the Trust. way, nothing. I have. I. I'm not here for what you think. Believe it or not, I know what it says. I know what I said. But Matt, you, that you see how this looks. Matt. Absolutely. Yes, that's what I'm saying. That's why I'd rather not be filmed. Obviously, I knew uh, when I walked in here that I didn't. You know, I didn't want to do anything. I just wanted to just kind of hang out. I have about an hour left. I'm about to go to sleep, and I have to work in the morning, and that's it. Matt tells me all this comes at an inconvenient time for him, as he has to work in the morning. Where do you work, Matt? I can't say that, sir. I'm going to find out. Please don't, because then I'll get fired. That's the only. If I lose that, I lose everything I have. I don't have anything, sir. Like, I'm alone in my life. I have nothing. Like, literally, everybody in my life is dead. My mom's the only one living. I take care of her the best I can. What the I, fuck? I mean, that's it. If I lose that, I lose everything I have. I can't lose everything I have because, well, who's going to take care of my dog? Who's going to take care of my house? What's going to happen to me? Because of Matt's actions, it looks like his mom and the dog will have to fend for themselves until he posts bail. Well, I understand all that, Matt, but at the same time, that doesn't make it okay to meet a 14-year-old boy absolutely, online for absolutely. sex. I don't know what is going First of all, I don't know what's going on right now, dude. I'm really freaked out. I don't know what's going on right now, dude. Well, I can tell you what's going on. You had a sexually charged conversation with somebody who absolutely, said they were 14. Absolutely, on a legal website. Absolutely. Yeah, but they said they were 14. I didn't see that. Oh, Matt. Do you know how many times I've heard that? I absolutely know because I know who you are. Okay, You're so you've seen, me right now. you've seen my shows. Yes, absolutely. What do you think of those shows? I think that is... I think that you're doing a great job. You're actually, I've seen you on a lot of other podcasts, too. You do a great job. That's why I'm wondering what is going on right now. What is going on is that we are doing a story. Right. An investigation on, a, my, fix my glasses, on adults my on adults who meet children for sex I online. I won't have them all. I'd really not rather not be filmed. Listen, I okay. don't want to be filmed. Oh, I don't, have a cho I don't have a choice in that in order no, to No, I you. think the police do, though. You walked in here and you gave up your right to privacy when you came no, no, into no, no. this I home. I, I walked into a house from a legal app where people meet. That's it. That's right, but you're not allowed to meet a 14-year-old boy for sex, man. I'm not, I, I'm not here for he that. He said he was 14. I First of all, I didn't say that. You didn't say anything about, I want that ass. A Can good you BJ. Prove that I said that? Yes, we have the text. From who? From you. Where from me? 
when you were texting the boy who said he was 14. But when I came in, what did I do? Nothing. You, I did absolutely nothing. Well, you came Actually, in like you own the place and sat down in the in the, the chair who walked by with a beer that, and reeking of weed. Uh, first of all, marijuana is legal in this. Fine. In I'm just saying. I'm saying what happened. User. And first of all, I still don't want to be filmed. If the sheriff, could you please tell them not to film me? They can't. Please. You don't have a choice here. Who's who's in charge? The sergeant over there. Well, sergeant sheriff. Sure, why sure. did you show up here in the first place, man? I told you. I just wanted to come by and hang out. And I thought the person was not that. I thought it was a joke, number one. Wait, 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 wait. You thought it was a joke. So I this all this talk about a BJ and well, getting all, that ass, that's a all, joke? You're just all, joking? Chris, first of all, Chris, yeah. the app is for people to meet. Just want to let you know that, number one. Just so so well, that kind of talk is not unfamiliar on a website like that, number one. Number two, if nothing happens, that's fantastic. I really could care less. Once again, I have to work in the morning about, I was going to go to bed in about an hour. I still can't believe this happened. I got to go to jail and I don't even know what's going to happen to me tomorrow because I have to call my work and tell them I'm not going to be there and I'm going to be in a lot of trouble as it is. All I have is this job. All I have is my house. I don't have anything in this life. I have nothing. What you see the a little fuck? backpack and then that phone that you grabbed? Like, five. bro, could you re like, do you really think that this is fake, bro? Someone saying this? I mean, I don't know, bro. All I have. I don't have anything. And what's what's anything. what's in the backpack, Matt? Just a couple beers for me, not for him. I didn't say I was going to give them anything or do it. I said I like to smoke. I like to drink. I didn't say I'm offering them anything. I didn't offer anything to a minor. I didn't say anything to a minor. I know that for a fact. I did not do that. This is a legal app where I talk to grown adults. I thought they were joking because it's uh, they always say that they're young. And then it's a 25 to 30 year old man. But I've never said to a 15 year old kid, hey, yo, let's do that. No, no. Then why I'm did not. you say it today, man? Because they didn't, they didn't, nobody's told me that. Yeah, they did, man. I've seen the transcripts. We okay, have the well, transcripts. Chris, Chris, not because uh, whether you believe me or not, I must have not have read it like that, or I thought it was just because I could have sworn they said laughing out loud, it's funny, ha, ha, ha. I'm like, all right, well, I'm just coming by to hang out. And, you know, let's just hang out and then we'll talk or whatever, whatever, but not to a hang out, year old Hang out and get a good BJ, have the 14-year-old suck your neck. These are, these are your words. Sir, I didn't say a 14-year-old, sir. He identified himself as 14. Sir, I'm telling you, that's what they do on this app. They do that all the time. I had a gentleman that said he was 20. He was actually in his 50s. Sir, I'm being serious. All right, let's get out. Let's take him But he said he was 14, man. I don't, I'm telling you, I do not, I'm telling you, I do not. I probably could have talked with Matt for another hour, but there's another man on his way. So we have to get Matt out of the house through the back door before the next guy arrives. Golf cart Matt is taken down to the sheriff's office for further questioning. I'm telling you, this is a huge misunderstanding, man. I understand. I, I don't, I don't, I don't think anybody's gonna believe me though. I really don't, man. But I know I didn't do anything wrong. I know that for a fact. Even in the hot seat, Matt is still talking in circles. You're saying that. You're saying that. Well, it says this about a 15-year-old, but nowhere after did I say, "Oh, that's." and I'm into that. I didn't say, so apparently I didn't read it like that or I didn't see it like that because I sure as heck didn't message afterwards anything that was like that. All I said was, hey, where do you live? I have about an hour because I got to go to work soon. And my interaction with him seems to have left a lasting impression. Once again, I don't know what the heck I'm here. You're saying uh, contributing to minors. So I go to a house, the guy, a guy's on a legal app. I go in there. I have a mic here for me, a little bit of weed for me. That's, that's mine. I didn't say I was giving you any, tell the person I'm doing anything with you. Nope. That's, this is for me. And then I go in there and all of a sudden I'm on the floor. And I got Chris Hansen. Of course, everybody knows Chris Hansen. Okay. I know what's going down, bro. Matt was charged with three felonies child abusive commercial activity, using a computer to commit a crime, and accosting a child for immoral purposes. This area of Monroe County seems to be a bit of a hotbed for but This is fake as fuck and Los is a sellout bitch go spin a slot pussy. Why is this dude Los is a bitch just in here talking shit, bro? What the fuck? And no, what was really going on was people were hitting up my shit talking about dudes getting head on stream and I'm like, bro, what else can happen to kick, bro? Like, dude, People come on here and just start doing crazy shit. Like, bro, what? Someone got head on shit. 
apparently someone was getting head on stream, bro. He was getting head though for real. Well, I hope I hope it's taken care of, bro. I hope it's taken care of, bro. Dad, come on, bro. Everything that you're, dude, you gotta understand, bro. These people want sh shit to fail, right? So you're gonna see clips on Twitter. Dudes are like, oh, Aiden Ross is watching porn. Streamer gets head. Fucking oh, Super Bowl. Fuck, like you know what I mean? Fuck. He got banned. I mean, dude, it's just like, what the fuck? And again, again, listen, it's in beta right now. When there's more moderation and shit and stuff, it's going to be fine. But like, damn, bro. Why are you complaining? Dude, what do you mean? Why am I complaining, bro? I don't want anything to happen to this fucking website, bro. <coughs> I think there's a good thing going on right now. I don't, I don't want anything bad to happen, bro. That's all I'm saying. <coughs> That's all I'm saying, bro. I don't want anything bad to happen. I really don't. I really fucking don't. You can't get head on streaming. You jealous, Willy Thunder. I thought I escaped you on Twitch, and now you're back. Now you're back. Willy Thunder, do you want mod? Fucking just closed out my chat by accident. Fuck. Mod me pussy. Yeah. The last person that I'm going to mod in here is someone called I Nut to Los Daily. That's a real name, by the way. Try to type it in the thing. At I Nut to Los Daily. That's literally I underscore nut underscore. Yeah, bro. Potential child predators as the decoys have another guy itching to meet an underage boy. The Viper decoy is talking to a guy named Jerry, who says he is 19 years old. No, he has not given me a location, but he said he's at his uncle's. Oh, he's visiting his uncle yeah. in this neighborhood. Yep. Do we know how far away he is, or we just know he's in the neighborhood? Um, 500 foot. Do you ever have a, one of these things where two different guys were in the same neighborhood, essentially? No. I mean, I've never seen it before in any no, I've, never, I've not had this happen. We've had them very close by where they're in walking distance. We've had walkers several times, but not this. I mean, we could see the last one down the street. Almost. And rather than him coming to us, he initially wants the 14-year-old boy to come to him. And his reason isn't one that I've heard before. He has a glory hole set up. He wants... In case you don't know, a glory hole is a hole in a wall designed for anonymous sexual encounters. Knowing I'm 14, wants me to come there, walk in, use it, and leave without ever seeing him or knowing him. This is a bad guy. Yes. What do you think the odds are this is the first time he's done this? Slim to none. But there's been a development with Glory Hole Jerry, and it's one that I've seen all too many times before. An admission. If you want some head, bro, I will still come. Just understand. Um, I don't understand. If not, let me know. I'm 47. Wow. If you want some head, bro, let... Dude, dude, dude. Are you fucking kidding me, bro? Imagine you're a 47-year-old man and your nickname is Glory Hole Jerry and you're talking to a what? A 14-year-old boy? First of all, like, that's one of the things right there where I'm like, oh, like... Um, I don't know, dude. It's, I think those people should get abused. Like, I already told you, instead of the death penalty, instead of, oh, life in prison, I think people who do certain types of things should get abused. There should be literally, I'm not kidding, in every jail, there should be like a few dudes who are hired str uh, strictly to be, um, uh, uh torturers. And if this is like a real thing that people know can happen to them, because if they're just like, oh, dude, fuck it, I could just go to jail. Ah, whatever, fuck it. Right? You need dudes in there who, who will torture. So you know if you do a certain thing, you're going to go in there and you're going to get tortured every day. 
So how many people would think, uh, you know, I've said this so many times. You might think, oh, it's inhumane. It's, yeah, but it's also inhumane, the shit that people do. The types of fucking murders. The fucking, the, the assaults. Sexual assaults. The fucking abusing children shit. That's inhumane, bro. So fuck it. Give them a taste of their own medicine. Why do they get to get coddled and now, now they go to jail? They have a place to sleep. I mean, they're living better than homeless people that might have lost their job and are unfortunate. You got dudes who are, who are fucking rapists, murderers, living better than fucking homeless people on the street, bro. They got a bed to sleep in. They get food every day. Fuck this shit, bro. They should be getting fucking abused and get thrown into a dungeon. And then, oh, maybe we'll give you some food if you feel like it. But, like, shitty food. Like, we'll throw it on the floor. You need to, like, eat, eat it with fucking dirt mixed into it. And that's your life now, bro. Like, do you know what I mean, dude? Like, abuse them, bro. They want to abuse and take advantage of innocent people. Take advantage of, you know, prey on, the, uh, on, on children. And, you know what I mean? What's wrong with that, bro? Fuck human rights, because you violated human rights. So now you lost your human rights, bro. You lost them, bro. You lost them. How is a rapist sleeping better at night than someone who might have lost their job and is now homeless, bro, and now has to sleep in the cold outside under a bridge and worried about getting stabbed, worried about getting fucking all his shit stolen? Oh, so he's gone from 19 to 47. Yeah. In the span of this conversation. Yeah. Bullshit. And he just said that that was a, fam a friend of a family's face right. picture. So, so he showed you a picture that was obviously He's trying to lure people in right, now. Younger. So this is a little bit more. Right. I mean, this is a predator. Right. Clearly. 47. Pretending to be 19, sending people's pictures yeah. of his. Right. To lure even younger kids. But it's clear to him that you're 14. Very clear. He's really about his glory hole. I mean, the fact that he's 47, and that takes this to a whole different level. He says, I'm looking to give oral and can truly deep throat you and swallow. This is grooming in real time. Yes. Glory hole Jerry is on his way. As the Viper team gets prepared, my team and I have to make sure all cameras are in place to capture the conference. React harder? Listen, all I know is this. Uh, there's like 13 minutes left of this video. Mark your fucking... Dude, set an alarm. Whatever you gotta do. Uh, Bernie, if you're in the chat, listen. Get ready. We're hitting a fucking 1,000x tonight. Fuck Skeeter. I don't give a fuck. We're hitting a 1,000x. We're winning a fucking million dollars. We're giving $50,000 away to the chat. I'm giving 100k to everyone in my family. We're going to fucking Dubai. Alright? We're hitting the fucking mill and the takedown and that the sting house looks like someone actually lives here the decoy is in position and ready to meet Jerry at the door vehicles off but also waiting for Jerry is me coming hey what's up what in how's it going good what's up All right. hey hold on I forgot my charger real quick oh you're fine so Sorry. You swear nobody's gonna be coming in. No, my mom's at work still. She'll be home not till like seven in the morning. Right there. Just okay. Have a seat. <laughs> so what are you up to tonight? How much? What's your plan? Meeting him. Meeting who? Him. Who is that? Travis. Travis. And what's your name? Jerry. Jerry. Jerry, where did you come from tonight? The other side of the park. Right in this neighborhood. No, on the other side of the park. Yeah, the other side of the park. Yeah. And how did you meet Travis? What do you mean, how did that meet him? How did you meet him? How did you find out that you should... He was on Grindr. On Grindr. And what was the... Dude, I don't know if it's because I've been eating healthy and shit. I, I, I have like a... I only ate once today. I have a little craving right now. This Little Caesars right here, bro. If I got a brand new, fresh out Little Caesars, I'm murdering five slices right now. I'm murdering five. I'm murdering five. You folded so quickly. I'm not folding, bro. I'm sitting here drinking water, bro. I'm good. 
I'm good. By the way, if you didn't hear what I said earlier, uh, we made uh, we made shrimp tonight. That shit was fire, bro. Shrimp is fucking delicious, dude. Um, and then I had salmon the night before. <gasps> so, I'm chilling, dude. I'm chilling, bro. And in, in the fridge still, matter of fact, I got turkey meatballs, bro. Fucking like 97% lean turkey meatballs, dude. Shit's fire, dude. Eating healthy is low-key if it feels better. Because you feel good the whole day. When you eat like shit, it makes you feel bad inside, dude. And then it makes you like not want to do shit. I'm telling you, bro. It's... it's li Dude, I'm not even kidding. It's literally poison, bro. It's fucking poison. And every time, I swear to God, it's like a drug, bro. Because I've fallen back into it and just, oh, oh, fuck it, I'll just eat that. Then it's like fucking days on the end. Then you're like, oh my God, what the fuck have I just done? I'm telling you, it's literally, it's like a drug, bro. It's literally a drug. Bad food, fast food, fucking all that shit is a drug. Anything that you like at a fast food place or anything like a pizza, whatever. You can make your own version of that shit, bro. Healthy. And it'll still taste good. I'm telling you right now, bro. I've seen someone on TikTok make a pizza in an air fryer using a fucking tortilla. And I tried that shit. It was fucking good, dude. Anyway, let's go. The discussion. How did you find out that you should... He was on Grindr. On Grindr. And what was the discussion on Grindr? I'm not... No, Jerry. You need... Don't... Don't... You can't leave here. Jerry tries to make a run for the door. But the Viper team doesn't let him get very far. Yeah. Oh, Patrick, you have your hands. Patrick, you have your hands. All Jerry. Right. All right, relax. Relax. Jerry. <laughs> Jerry, guess what, buddy? No glory holes for you today, buddy. Relax. Relax. Bring your hand back here. All right. Bring your hand back here. All right. Got it. Got it. Moving in. Jerry, how old did Travis say that he was in your conversation? Jerry? Jerry? Just relax, Jerry. I got a bad back, guys. We'll help you out. Just relax, okay? You can see the scar. Another one. Another set. Oh. Just relax, Jerry. We'll get you set up here in a second. Oh my God. So on three, we're gonna set you on your behind. Ready? One, two, three. Oh, oh, oh my back. Oh. Suddenly, Jerry says he's in pain. And like many alleged predators, he tries to get sympathy after he's caught. But his diversion is not going to work. My back is killing me. All right, you wanna be checked out by, the, by medical? Ugh. Even I am going to take a seat for this one. What we're going to do here is medical is not going to come here. We're going to oh. take you to them. Okay. okay. So uh. we need you to relax. Jerry. Oh. Jerry, there's something you need to know. Oh, my back. Jerry. What? I'm Chris Hansen. I know who you are. How do you know who I am? Oh, because I've, I've said I would never do this and I did it anyway. Why did oh. you do it, Jerry? Because I'm stupid. It seems like your back is the least of your problems right now. Oh, my God, my back is killing me. <laughs> okay, well, that'll be addressed in a minute here, but why did you think it was okay to have this sort of conversation with somebody who said they were 14? Oh, because I'm stupid. <sighs> you talk about a glory hole, wanting the boy to go oh to your house. Oh, God. Oh, my back is killing me. Okay, there's, there's not a lot of sympathy here because of what you were here to do, Jerry. Do you understand that? I understand that. I have had surgery twice on my back, okay? okay? But you're also, And my back is hurting now. They're going to take care of that. But first, I want to know <sighs> what you were thinking by coming over here to try to I have was sex. stupid, I'm telling you. Stupid. What do you do for a living, Jerry? Uh, nothing. I'm disabled. You're disabled. How long have you lived in this area? Oh, my God, my back. Jerry. What? How long have you lived in this area? Five years. Five years. And I've never done this You've before. Never done it before. Ever. You seemed very oh. experienced at it, Jerry. You, I'm not. First so. of all, you said oh. you're first of all you said you're nineteen. You sent a fake picture. Whose picture was that of the nineteen year old? <laughs> Jerry? What? Whose picture, picture was it? picture I got offline. Offline. But you said you were 19. Oh. Why would you tell somebody you were 19? Because I'm stupid. You're I stupid. told you. That's it. You're just uh, stupid. Yes. And what about all this talk about a glory hole and wanting the boy to come to you for sex? You talk about deep-throating him that you'd swallow. 
Why is there a username in here called Los Fatty TV Harassed Me? Typing spamming, actually, you will get a six pack before hitting a thousand X. Give it up. Is this a fucking joke, dude? It's 2 30 in the morning on kick.com. All right. And you still found a way to troll. You still found a fucking way, bro. Yeah, Bullshit. I was stupid. I was really fucking stupid. Well, what do you think would have happened, Jerry, had we not Nothing. been here and a 14-year-old boy had been here? Nothing. I really wanted to see if he was real. That's it. Okay. Well, you saw see that. See if he was walked real. In, you you very fucking excited. pervert fuck. You even asked if anybody else was here. Why would you ask? Fucking that? pervert. Dumb. Okay, that doesn't wash, Jerry. You're more than dumb. You were God here to damn, prey I'm on hurting. the child. They're going to take care of that in a minute. Oh. You think you're hurting? How would a 14-year-old boy feel after you sexually assaulted them? I wasn't going to do anything. Okay, but that's not what you said in the chat, is it, Jerry? No, it's not. I said that already. Looking for but some asking great me head. the same questions. I already said that. Well, explain I it. I up. Okay, I did a stupid thing. I don't need that in my face. Well, you sort of don't have a choice, Jerry. Yeah, I do have a choice. Did nope. they double cuff him? I don't need that in my face. They have to double <laughs> Well, you sort of don't have a choice, Jerry. Yeah, I do have a choice. No, you don't, really. Jerry turns away from me and the camera. What's your tattoo of, Jerry? I'm not talking to you anymore, so... Pouting like a child. You have nothing else you want to say? No. And you want me to believe that this is the first time you've done this? Well, I'm telling you, this... <gasps> triple! It's triple! <laughs> Holy fuck, it's triple! And you want me to believe that this is the first time you've done this? Well, I'm telling you it is. So Triple's whatever. insane. Triple. You see crazy. why I would not believe that? I don't care if you believe me or not. You see how this looks? <laughs> you laughing, but you need the same thing! Gatsby. Again, this is kick, so I don't have to worry about the Twitch rules. I would beat the fuck out of you if I saw you in real life, bro. I, I, oh my god, I would, bro. Not in GTA. Yeah, I know how it looks. It's really fucking dumb of me for doing what I did. Really fucking dumb. And you see why it would be hard for me to believe this is your first time doing it. Well, I don't care if you believe me or not. I'm telling you it is, so... You just woke up today and said, I'm going to try to meet a 14-year-old boy online for sex. No, I wasn't, actually. I was looking for older. Okay, but you found a 14-year-old and you acted upon it, didn't you? Yeah, I like an idiot. Okay. I knew better than that too. Do you have a glory hole in your home? No. Why did you say it, then? Because I would have made one, but not for him. Wait, you said you would have made a glory hole for this boy? No, not for the boy! Well, that's what you said, Jerry. That's not what I meant. Sounds like Jerry's. Yeah, I'm gonna I'm gonna make a custom go dude. This is sick, bro. Dro uh, yo, Draco, thank you for the uh the new sub. Thank you. Hey, we're almost at 300 subs on on kick. <gasps> um, we've had this we've had the subs for uh for like a couple days now. So I appreciate you guys. I appreciate it. Starting to get angry. You're trying to get me all fucked up now, and I'm not doing it. Jerry, have you seen my shows before? Yes. What did you think of those shows? Mano, what do you mean by you usually skip this part? I want to know what you're watching where it starts like this, bro. I need to know. I need to know, bro. How stupid the people were. Did you ever think you'd be on one of those no, shows, No, because I'd never wanted to do anything like this before in my life. Why today? Because I'm stupid. I told you I made a dumb ass decision. Just shut up, Jerry. You sent a picture Just of somebody who was 19. Up. And then once you figured out that the 14-year-old you thought you were talking to might be open to sex, <coughs> you say, oh, wait, I'm 47. Is that okay? It sounds like grooming to me, Jerry. No, it wasn't. Well, I what was is stupid. it? Tell me, tell me what it is. I told you I was stupid. <laughs> All right, that's a cop-out, Jerry. You're not, you're not getting to the truth here. I'm telling you the truth. I was stupid. I was dumb. And now you're getting arrested. I gotta face it now. Nothing I can do about it. What do you think should happen to you, Jerry? 
Jerry. I didn't do anything to Jeez. anybody, but yes, I was dumb. The crime was committed in the chat. I know that. So you know the law, right? Yeah. Yo, yes, Sirski. Thank you for the sub. And so it's hard for me to believe that had we not been here, it seems like you would have done something. Yeah, can you quit talking because I really don't want to listen to you. I just want to go down to the jailhouse, call my lawyer. Why is there... Part. I'm tired of listening. Bro. To you. You're tired of listening. I just saw someone type, I've had two back surgeries. I look at their username, Glory Hole Jerry 14 Are you serious? Listen to me. Yeah. Guys, yeah. stop, bro. Is there anything else Make you your name no, your Twitch you. name, bro. Yeah, don't f***ing do it. You're stupid if you do. Don't care. Jerry, thanks for talking to us. So annoying, dude. These these guys want to take over from here. Jerry, come on. Let's turn around back on your uh, back on your butt. You're going to have to help me get up. Right? We'll help you. He's taken away by the Monroe County Sheriff's Office Viper Task Force. But something happens on the way to the Sheriff's Office Detention Center that shocks even me. Sergeant Mike Predmore fills me in on the details. So you heard from the transport crew and the people at the Sheriff's Department? Yeah, I got a telephone call from Detective Davison that was uh, transporting Jerry to the substation for an interview. And during the ride, uh, Jerry offered up information about our location. And he actually was uh, glad that we're here because there's a lot of people in here that are just like him. Yo, Spat, really? thank you for the sub, bro. Yeah. Appreciate so you. He even brought up a, the guy that drives the green golf cart that stops and talks to a lot of kids in the neighborhood. Wait, so Jerry, who was just arrested for showing up here to have sex with a 14-year-old boy, tells your detective that he's glad we're here because this place is filled with predators? That's what he told him, yes. Yeah. What do you make of that? I mean, you can't make this stuff up, right? So that's telling me that we're here, we're in the right spot. Willy Thunder, you said imagine subbing on kick. I'm just gonna say this right now. People who are subbing, I appreciate you. This dude, Willy, you're subbed for I don't know how many fucking months on Twitch. And I'm gonna, I'm gonna say this right now, okay? On kick, the, the creator gets 95%. Kick gets 5%. On Twitch, it's 50-50. So you're laughing, but you would rather give half your money to Jeff Bezos. That's what you're... You're laughing, but you'd rather give half your money to Jeff Bezos. I want to know how that makes sense. Imagine you're walking down the street, and there's a street performer, and he's like doing like a nice song. You're like, damn, this shit nice, bro. You're like, you know what? Let me give him five bucks. As soon as you go to give the five bucks, this dude walks out of a out of a fucking Rolls Royce, takes your five bucks, and just gives him two fifty, and then walks back. <clears throat> Fair? Okay. But we're doing a good thing to get these people off the street. While in custody, he's seen by EMTs for his complaints of pain. And not surprisingly, they find no serious injuries. But, uh, and Jerry decides to tell the detective about his concern. Did I say anything about yeah, I yeah, I I I don't know why he decided to come on, on, on kick and get head. I don't understand why he did that. It's literally fucked up. Um you know, it's just going to make Kick look bad. And, like, he, I, I mean, he doesn't care. I mean, no one who would come on here and do that even cares about the website. Um, you know, I gave Aiden the benefit of the doubt with the show and the, uh, with typing in Pornhub.com. He didn't watch porn um, on stream, but he did go to the, he typed in the website. Um, but all these things make the website look bad because it's the only thing you're hearing about the website. Like none of these accounts are going to post funny moments from the stream. They're not posting the funny dude. You know how many funny moments you've had on Omegle and prank calling and, and whatever else we've done. They're not posting that. They're not posting whatever funny moments Aiden has had or 
train or anything like that or anything. Like, they're going to post shit that's dramatic, that's going to get views, that's going to, like, be controversial. So you can't give these people any any energy. You can't give these people any uh, ammunition, bro. Now look. Now they have more. I'm, I'm sure tomorrow they'll be like, oh, dude, guy was getting head on stream. Like, And again, nothing's going to happen to this website, okay? They just got to be stricter on the rules. And I heard he got banned anyway, so that's good that he got taken down when he was doing that. Um, but, yeah. <clears throat> I don't know. Um, I think that, I don't think Aiden did anything fucking like, I don't think that that, dude, he didn't watch, again, he didn't watch porn. He just typed in Pornhub.com. That's it, bro. Fuck. Keep that same energy about someone who just got head on stream, bro. He did, I think. Are you just jealous because 47 of your 50 bodies were in a glory hole? Learns about one of his neighbors. So tell me more about, you said, I know you mentioned something about there's other people in the park. What do you, what do you know about these other people? I know the guy with the green golf purse. Creepy, I mean, there's other... Do you know his name? Can you, can you describe that for me? Does he live around you? He says to some people that he's in his 40s. Other people, he says he's 30. I know that he hit me up on Grinder and he said he was 30, but he looks like he's in his late 40s. Um, Have you ever met with him? No. Just creeped me out. And um, I see him. Yeah, he. Yeah, yeah. So now this dude. Glory Hole Jerry is in here snitching on other pedos now. You can't make this up. Now you get caught. And, oh, but this guy creeps you out. Yeah. Not the dude. Not you. Not you who's going to literally design a glory hole for a 14-year-old in your house. Okay. I'm done. I'm sick of this shit. 